Stock trading is documented in ancient writings as early as 400 BC, but the most significant initial sale of stocks to the public occurred in Amsterdam in 1602 with the establishment of the Dutch East India Company as an international spice company. Over the years, additional public companies were established in Amsterdam, and stock trading took on an organizational nature. Some few years later in London, 1693, the first bonds began to be traded. Immediately afterward, several British companies began trading shares of their stock. London's first stock traders operated in coffee shops on Change Street, adjacent to the Royal Exchange Trading Center. These early stock traders were not allowed to enter the Royal Exchange because of their known bad habits. In 1698, one John Casting, who liked to conduct business in Jonathan's Coffee House, began hanging a list of stocks and their prices outside the coffee house. This list is considered the first milestone in establishing London Stock Exchange. Over the years to follow, several companies rose and fell, but the most widely known case was that of the South Sea Company, established in 1711 for the purpose of trade with South America. The company's shares were snapped up, their price rocketing upward. Within a few years, it became apparent that expectations of successful trading with the New World were exaggerated. And in 1720, prices fell in one sudden drop, creating the first bubble burst. In 1789, stocks and bonds began to be traded in the United States. Thank you for watching our video. Before you go, we invite you to join the TradeNet Trading Room for a free 14-day trial. TradeNet has educated more than 30,000 professional traders worldwide since 2004, and its trading room is one of the world's leading trading communities. Click here to start your free trial. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can view many more stock trading videos. Questions or comments, please submit them below.